Hi students, welcome to Vichkem YouTube channel. In this video, I am going to tell you four reasons why there is no chance of the re-knit. 99.99% there is no chance of the re-knit. With the complete explanation, with the complete analysis, I am going to tell you because most of the students are in the tension whether should I start studying or not and I, people are not able to focus on the counseling documents. Already we have a video what documents you should keep it ready. So every time people are watching about the videos which are about the re -need only in this place that happened, in that place though so many people are arrested like that people are in the tension. So to relieve from the tension only this video is made and is, please share this video to all those students who are also in the same condition. Those who are in the tension that again re -need may happen or not. Okay, so I am also saying 99.9% because whatever the situations happening in and around regarding the NEET and how people are misguiding like yesterday and NET exam is cancelled and people are worried that it is about the NEET. No, it is not about the NEET, UGC NET that is after the MSc only that exam is conducted. So not for the uh, intermediate students or 10 plus 2 students. So that is different and that is not conducted uh, before conducting only exam is cancelled. So don't get misguided by the different videos and with the relevant videos. So be peaceful and re be, uh, watch this video till the last and once video is ending I'm, I, was, I was guiding about the NEET counseling, what document you are supposed to have and what is the procedure, which website you should uh, apply for the, what every procedure I am going to tell you. Already we have some videos about the uh, AIMS cutoff videos. So, so many videos are already there. So, you can check out in the description box. So, and where you will get the complete information, what videos are there. And also in future, I am going to make some more videos. So, definitely subscribe this channel, press bell icon and suggest your friends. By suggesting your friends, they are also benefited. I will, al I will also feel encouraged. And if you like the video, then automatically the YouTube will suggest to the, all the students, those who are tension like you. So coming to the topic reason one, punish the guilty. See if you see the track record of the Supreme Court, it is never punishing the those who are not do, done the mistake. Those who are done the mistake, they are only punished. Okay, so those who are involved in the scam, they are only punished. For example, 1563 students only given the need, not everybody because they got the marks unnecessarily. So second thing, if the somebody is doing scam that is those people only the officials involved only will be treated by the law and those students who got the more marks due to the malpractice only may be given re -need. not everybody first thing supreme court always tries to think by punishing the guilty okay uh, next one reason to infrastructure and conducting the re-exam for 24 lakhs nearly 24 lakh students is not a joke it involves so many agencies to combine so many examination halls to be re made prepared the uh, almost largest exam conducted in the india so these many students accommodating giving them again admit card again allotting the centers and again invigilation again uh, correction of the pay omr and again the result so that infrastructure is not it is not a joke so this much infrastructure for the sake of for punishing the for, uh, 10 members 15 members maximum 100 2000 like that may be there so for saving that uh, for benefit of the 20 uh, 2000 people who made mistake putting the infrastructure is not possible second thing is infrastructure third one affected students see here if the out of the 24 lakhs, already 1563 people, those who got extra marks due to the grace marks are already got the uh, separate ranking. And those who are affected, like in Bihar, some gang is arrested in uh, Gandhi Nagar, in, uh, in the 
Gujarat somebody is arrested. So those people only affected. So because of the few affected people, for example, only 1% or 2% people only affected and got the good marks and good ranks. So for the sake of 1 or 2% of the students, punishing everybody, asking every, <coughs> every students to prepare once again, write the exam. For 1 or 2% student, you cannot punish the 98 to 99% of the students. Again studying, again, again writing the exam, again going to the exam hall, again checking the results. So this is going to be a problem. So the affected students by the scam only will be separately dealt then next one and most important one is the reason for counseling delay if this happens it will take almost two months that means uh, counseling will also be delayed by two months that means mbbs class start also will be affected so that is going to affect the medical practicing so that counseling delay even you can check till now the supreme court never said uh, stop the counseling so stay on counseling is not given because they know the importance of the counseling and joining to the mbbs colleges as soon as possible so that your first year should not be hampered so these are the four reasons which made me to think that 99.9 percent .9 chances of reneat is not there only 0.1 percent chances may be there so i think you all feel understood and share this video subscribe my channel press bell icon join my telegram group see you bye bye